Hey guys, we're here in a new world. Now, today uh, it might be a little laggy because all the NPCs, but it's been a lot of thought and it's taken a lot of time, but I've decided to make a new modded series. And the mod I picked after a lot of consideration and a lot of different tests that I did is the Tinker's Construct mod. Now, I know quite a bit about this, but I don't know everything about this. So I, I do have the wiki pulled up next to me on my iPad. And the first thing I did was I wanted to find a village because I didn't want to build a house at first. I wanted to come here and make it easy on myself. So that's exactly what I did. I came here and I know about these. Oops. I know about these. And this is actually part of the Tinker's Construct mod. But I'm not going to bore you with all that stuff. This is day one. And before we get very far into this, I want to... Um, Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to hit that like button. It really helps me out. And subscribe if you're new. Comment if you have any suggestions. Because I really, I really would like to know what you guys think I could do better. So. I picked out a house. Oh, is this like... Oh, we don't want that up. Okay. Now, is this a carpet? No, that's a full on block. Okay, we don't, we don't want to mess anything up too bad. Now, actually, you know what, this is going to be really useful because I'm going to want to make a bed. Now, it might be a little laggy because this, oh, it's actually running fairly well. But with all the villagers, oh, and here's the actual guy. He, I don't want that trade. With all the villagers... It, it's gonna probably lag quite a bit. This is my house. Get out. Get out. This is gonna be my house. Even though I did kind of take it from him. Now I have a very basic setup at this time. And I don't have anything to do with the Tinker's Construct mod yet. But I, w I didn't want to like come in here and do all this stuff. And then you, you guys come in and say, all right, well, You don't need to cheat. So I decided just to come on in here and start exactly from scratch, which I, I normally don't do. I normally gather some materials and stuff like that, make it easy on myself. Now this is going. This house is going to get much bigger eventually, with how I'm going to set it up, but. For right now, it's just gonna it's just gonna remain this small uh, hunk of junk. Eventually, my plans are to really branch out onto this. I really want to kind of attach these and get rid of. Oh crap! Yeah. Well, uh, I kind of got off topic there. I want to get rid of the gap in between there because I think it'd be one. It'd make the ha it'd make it a lot bigger, which needs to happen. And two, it's something that should probably be pro probably be done. Excuse me. Now let me take this out. Luckily, this wasn't actually too far spawn was over there just a l little farther than maybe like 20 blocks or m no more than 20 blocks maybe like 50 blocks but it wasn't really that far in, in the scheme of everything so excuse me guys I'm gonna take down these houses and all the small houses and then I'll be Ooh. hey guys I'm back and well, it's been a while. I've done quite a bit, and I haven't gone mining yet. I haven't found a cave anywhere. I kind of looked, and then I kind of got bored, and I, I just stopped looking. But real quick, let's show you what I've done. Now, for my house, it's, it's getting quite out of hand. It's turned into something 
that. You're gonna need to have more room and things of that nature. <clears throat> but that's okay because I'm willing to do that. And sorry if you can hear my dog in the background. She won't be quiet. But I've demolished this house and that's actually where I got the fences. And I demolished some of the houses over here. Which was okay. I didn't I haven't gotten around to demolishing some of the others and I don't know why this one will eventually I will probably I want to say I'll burn it down but I'm not quite sure what I'll do with it it might be nice to like branch over to eventually but yeah I don't want to get too out of hand because I will move out of this town eventually like I say keep saying eventually that's gonna happen I did uh, she won't quiet down but I moved the door from over here to over here that uh, I thought that was needed it, it really should have happened and then this will eventually be guys I am so terribly sorry for that but I just let her out of her cage and she's she's not barking anymore so along with the other things we did now I figured out that these were hollow up here, which I, I had never known before, which was weird. Because usually I know. But I did not. So I hollowed it out, and now it looks like this. And I, I think to add an effect here, I want to just. Oh, don't double click. Oh, the sounds are really low. There. Of course, I should probably turn the sound of the villagers down. Because if not, it's going to bug me. But yeah. These are dormer windows. I, I don't know if you guys know what those are. But I've used them a lot in my Minecraft builds. Because they can make things look really, really nice. And then I'm not sure what this is going to be. I have no idea where my smeltery and stuff's gonna be at this point I really don't and I'm pretty sure sh someone just came in my house I'm gonna need to put an iron door on here no I guess not just a second I'm gonna I want to turn the sounds down okay yeah so we don't have to listen to the villagers at this moment and then I, I was gonna work on doing this I was gonna work on taking all this stuff in here and moving it over cuz I'm gonna have to do that at some point but I, I don't know I, right now I'm kinda stuck on wh what I'm gonna do but this is going to seem really choppy, but I think I'm going to leave you guys real quick. And I am going to go build a little workstation. I don't know. It's probably going to be over there somewhere. So I will meet you guys back here when I have that done. We'll go through some stuff. And that will probably be about the end of the episode. So, sorry for so many skips, but things need to get done, and these things are usually pretty boring to watch. And usually it takes quite a bit, because it takes me a long time to make up my mind. But I will see you guys in just a minute. Hey guys, I'm back. <clears throat> and, as you can see, I, I put a roof on this, which really needs to happen. But, you can see, I don't have it completely done, but I do have the foundation done. And that's kind of what I needed for now, because I ripped the roof off of that, and I was thinking, well, it's okay, I'm just going to tear it down anyways, but the more I think about it, the more houses I keep tearing down, the less of a village this is actually going to be. And I kind of want it to be a village. So, uh, uh, I think I still have some cobblestone on me, apparently not. I, I, I didn't use it all, but... Here we go. So I'm going to go replace a tad bit of the roof that I kind of destroyed. And it's just not going to look the exact same for right now. Oops. 
That wasn't supposed to happen. Oops. Ah. Sorry, you guys, I just hit my mic. <laughs> Okay, so there we go. We we filled it. Back he's not gonna care. He he really won't. He's just got a taller roof than everybody else, except for me. So like come on in here guys and I'll I'll uh, we want that shut just in case it turns not on us, even though I did just sleep. And I got kind of a cluttered inventory, I guess I can put that in there but follow me into here and this is just the shape of it now now later when I have the uh, smeltery I don't know I'm pretty sure I'm gonna the smeltery it's gonna be three by three on the inside so what I want it to do is I wanna go one two three one two and then no, wait, that's not gonna work. Wait, but the this would be the wall. This would be the wall. So you have one, two, one, two, and then three, four on the outside, and then you go around. I don't know. I'm just rambling on at this point. <laughs> okay. But yeah, so I have done a little bit to my house. Yeah, and I'm feeling pretty good. I need to figure out how to make this meltery because that's going to be a big part of what this is all about, basically. I'm just going to have to work with this. And this is going to be awfully big. I mean, it already is. That's probably going to be storage stuff and everything. But what I was saying is I, I'd fill this in. Let me actually fill this in now. Oops. And it, it would protrude out here, so it'd be like here, out here, and you just see the black stone brick. I don't know what it is. It's seared stone brick or something like that. And that would be slightly out, and it'd give it kind of a cool effect. So, I mean, that, that'd that be pretty cool. But I want to come in here and... I don't know if I'm going to have enough room in here. You know what, just a second. <laughs> but we should probably make another chest. We won't do a double chest. We'll do something like. Um, no. Nah, we won't do that. We can pop one here and then maybe. Or, you know what, Woody? <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm kind of indecisive about this right now. That's why I didn't want to have you guys watch me build that, be, that room because it, it took a long time just to figure out the floor plan even though it looks fairly simple right now and then I I did the roof and everything and that took a little while so it, it's just how it went and I couldn't change it get out of my way move okay now we can yeah. I didn't completely clear my inventory Oops, we don't want that. The pattern chest, that is, uh, this is going to be a pain in the butt. Uh, okay, okay. So, we have that. I guess we should go empty this out right now. And you know what? I'm kind of glad I didn't oops, completely empty my inventory, I guess, because if we make two more chests, 
we can put a double chest in the smeltery room. And we, we can put them for right now right in the inside here. And there's another thing that I know I want to do. Just a second, guys, because I gotta get on the wiki. Just gotta open up my iPad. Now, I do know that there is an amazing thing that you can do. It's like an island. I mean, actually, I think I can do it right now. I think I actually remember what it is. Now, if we come in here, and this, this will be cool for everything that we do. Now, if we go. And don't worry, I have plenty of wood, as you saw. There's no shortage of that. Put this back in there. And we go in here. We go. Yep, I got it right. It's exactly what I want. And this will look cool all over the whole house. And I'll show you what they do. These are really cool. It's called a drying rack. And now it's for zombie brains, but that's not what I'm going to use it for. Uh, in here, we don't have much room anywhere. Hmm. I guess they won't go in there. They'll go in here. I'm going to just break this glass because is probably gonna get taken out anyways really the actuality of things is probably like I said just gonna get taken out it's not gonna stay there for long okay so put that stuff back now drying rack is really cool no now when I walk into the house you're not gonna notice it unless that's full that's completely full huh I guess I can put this up in my room just on this wall I guess no I can't put that on that wall well I guess I'll just have this in my inventory for now but let me show you what it does so let's say I don't have anything in my inventory that I could do but let's say I just wanna pop that up there see and it holds stuff and it makes it look really cool and then when you want it what you do to get it up there is right click on the item itself now when you want it back you just right click it again see really easy that's enough that's enough tutorial for right now let's put this stuff in here uh... the drying racks gonna have to stay with me set unfortunately for now I guess I could actually put it in here and let's just take all this out all the wood working stuff or wood stuff except for that uh, I, I don't know what I left in there huh that's weird I, I guess I can go up there and sleep real quick Yeah. Last time I got kind of click happy trying to go to bed. But let's go down here. Oh crap. I can't get that. Let's go back down to that place and we are going to get the rest of that stuff along with that piston. I don't know what the pistons are going to be good for at this moment, but. I guess we can get the pattern chest because this is going to be useful. We can grab this. 
and then the really the only thing after this that we'd be missing oh wait what, what do we have here part builder tool station okay and then this will be this is the stencil table okay okay so that's good we we've, we've rated this for just about all it's worth we really need to go go mining at some point because we need we one we need precious metals which is going to be a very important part and then two uh, we're going to have to move this two we're going to need uh... i, I don't know what it's called never mind I, I don't i don't know what i'm talking about apparently I don't know how exactly to set this up right now. Now this is the stencil table, so this can be right here, over here, because this is where I make the stencils. It's not going to be needed. Now the part builder and the tool station, yeah, that's probably where the pattern chest needs to go. So... Okay, there we go, there we go. Now, you know what? I actually want to try to get a smeltery station, I guess, in here today. So, I'm going to try to get all that stuff, and then I will be back with you when I have it all, or close to enough. So, I will see you guys in just a sec. Hey guys, I'm back, <clears throat> and this is a, just a really, really quick update. I finally got my smeltery done. It's been maybe three hours. I've had to eat and do a whole bunch of other stuff, but yeah. So I got this done, and you can see the liquid metal on the inside. I have a lot of iron ore that I've picked, but I have found a little bit of copper. And I just made this window so you can kind of see in. And my casting table and all that other cool stuff. But I have all this stuff that I want to make. Because I want to make a sword and a, a pickaxe. But I don't have any gold. And you can only cast with gold. So I'm going to have to go find that. The, like I said, this was only going to be a quick update real quick. And, so I'm going to go find some gold. And when I do, I will meet you guys back here. And we're going to make some stuff in our first episode. I think it's going to be absolutely amazing. So I will see you guys in just a second when I've found some gold or when I'm down in a cave. So see you in. We are back here and we have everything. And look in here. Boy, I found a lot of stuff in there. Not to mention, before we get on to the crafting and smelting and all that fun stuff, I, I have to show you something. I, I had no idea these spawned down in the caves, but they do. Look, they're all bushes. I believe those are copper ore bushes. Those are ten. Those are ten. That's, yeah. Yeah. Copper, tin, iron, more copper, and then these are XP berry bushes. Yeah, and when you step on them, you get hurt very badly. I made that mistake down there, and it, it really did end badly. So here you go. As you can see in there, the... Stuff's been raised quite a bit. And I believe I have gold at the bottom. So we're going to make some casts. I can put this one back. You know what? I'm just going to make casts for quite a few things. So here we go. 
Just wait for this to dry. This is taking an awful long time. It usually doesn't do this. Take this long. Um, you know what? Um, just a second. I have had this problem before. So, let's grab this. So it's still not dry. Sometimes you just have to break it. That's the only way. It, it sometimes just glitches out. I don't know. It's just taking an awful long time. I, I don't know why. I think I'm going to have to figure this out. So I'll be right back, you guys. I'm sorry. Give me just a second. Okay, that only took a quick minute. I, I, I don't really know what went wrong there. When I turned the recording off, it, it started to do it. I actually switched out what it was. I did the sword first, and then it magically worked. So I don't know. No, we're... Well, I said I would, wanted to do a sword first, and first I have to look at the tool builder. What does this need? No, long sword. Okay, I'm trying to see. Low damage, low durability. <laughs> Okay, so I guess we'll just go with that for right now. Now, what do we want this made out of? That's the question. Bronze might be... How about bronze? See if we can do bronze, because not everyone works. Oh, looks like bronze works, though. Okay, so we have a bronze... <clears throat> bronze that maybe something different for this can we go aluminum brass um, I'm guessing no on that aluminum I don't think we have enough aluminum no, we don't. Uh, not enough copper. Quite an, we have enough gold. I don't know why we don't have enough. Enough. What is it? I don't know why we don't have enough. What it? Cap? Not copper what the heck am I trying to say uh, aluminum brass was it yeah I don't know why we don't have enough of that but here's the last part and this is the tool rod I don't know why it's not pouring out that's weird I guess that just doesn't work gold would be pretty cool not gonna lie. I guess it doesn't work for that though. And I'm kinda running low on. Kinda running low on lava. I'm gonna have to get some more of that at some point. Let's see if this even works with. Like. This. What what what's gonna work? Aluminum? No. I'm trying to figure it out. You know what? I could probably fill this up with this stuff real quick. 
just because I don't need it and it will fill it up a little bit but I guess we just go for bronze I, th I thought we already had a bronze yeah we do well that's Pour out some of the bronze. I think it just didn't work. We didn't have enough right there. So. Ten. Let's see if we can get a ten. Uh, what just happened? Come on, we need something. There we go, copper. Okay, now we're going to put this stuff back. And we're going to make, oh, the oddest looking... Pickaxe? No sword that anybody's ever laid eyes on. So here we go. It's a very weak sword. <laughs> but I bet it looks really nice. Ooh, that looks amazing. That's worthy of getting hung up. That is very nice looking. So, uh, I'm going to tinker around with this. Uh, that I guess that could have been a pun. But, I'm going to play around with this mod, see what I can do. And next time, when you come back here, hopefully I'll have something amazing for you guys. But for right now, that's all I have. So, until next time, don't forget to hit that like button subscribe if you're new but I'll be seeing you later bye